Hey everyone, welcome to my Photoshop tutorial and today I'm going to teach you about the Refine Edge tool in Photoshop CS5. Now first things first, you want to select your image that you want to use this on. So you want to go to File and Open and select your image. Once you've loaded your image in Photoshop, then you want to choose the Quick Selection tool or you could either use the Magic Wand tool. Now the Quick Selection tool is much faster, so I prefer to use that. Then I've made a just a rough uh, selection. Now you'll see that there is some fine hairs that I've missed out, but this is what the Refine Edge tool is for. So once you've made your selection, you just want to click on the Refine Edge, which is at the top. Now I like to see a uh, view mine on a white background. You can see all the little things. Now you want to click the Smart Radius and then bring the radius right up so give it time to render and then all of a sudden it's basically taken the black out of the background and you can see all the fine little hairs now also you can use the um, output so you want to decontaminate colors which basically is the kind of colors that merge into the tips of everything so say if you have like a light you don't want it to be it's going to shine onto the the tips of the hairs which is basically uh, contamination so you want to press that and you can bring the amount up and if there is still parts that you want to be taken out you can use the brush tool or and if you've taken too much out you can use the you can switch over to the eraser tool which is at the top up here so basically then you just go over the bits that you either want to take away or replace again and you can also adjust the edge by either using the smooth feather contrast or shift edge now the shift edge tool basically see if you look at it the shift edge tool if I bring it down it's going to take it right in but you don't want it like that or if I take it all the way up it's going to base basically put the edge right out again so you want it like basically in the middle to where it was last time and there you go you've got all the fine hairs and everything that is perfectly selected and then press OK and then basically let it load for a while and then it's taken all of the background away and you've left with the fine hairs so when you replace it in a different image you have every single bit of her that you wanted so this is for Photoshop CS5 and you're not going to get this in Photoshop CS4 or later versions so only in the new version so I hope you like this tutorial and please comment, rate and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.